second round has come to a close. The Denver Broncos making that final selection. So we're going to check, on, check in with Locked On Broncos. Cody Rourke joins us. Nick Bonito is the pick. As we see here for them adding to their defense, what was your immediate thought? Where does he fit in right now? Well, for the Denver Broncos, edge rusher was a big area of concern for them after they traded away Von Miller. This was actually the pick that they acquired from the Rams in the Von Miller mm -hmm. trade. So Nick Benito, for him, obviously last season, 15 tackles for a loss. He's got that speed rusher element to him. A little bit interesting to note, though, because they still have Bradley Chubb and they still have Randy Gregor, who was one of the key offseason acquisitions at edge rusher. And Randy Gregory is expected to be ready for the regular season after having shoulder surgery. But after that, the Broncos edge rusher rotation is split between seventh rounder Jonathan Cooper and undrafted rookie free agent from 2019 and Malik Reed. So I imagine Benito will fill in really quickly here in a zero Evros defensive scheme immediately here in 2022. Is this where we see them go a little bit vintage Denver where they just want to get as many defensive players as they can and just try to knock everybody out? Well, they have a few more picks coming up here, probably the next 20 picks. I think they have two picks remaining here in round three coming up. So George Payton, I think at this point, the Broncos roster is fairly intact for the most part, maybe offensive line, maybe cornerback. But at this point, I think anybody Denver selects will be a luxury pick, best player available for them going forward through the rest of this year's draft. All right, Denver's up at 75. Cody, we'll check in with you a little bit later as well. We're into the third round now. 